Hello and welcome to this video um, about uh, various different browsers that are available for the Mac. Uh, I wanted to do something a bit different from the usual which is the fastest browser style video because an nth of a second is not really um, going to make any difference really to anyone. So I thought I'd deal, deal with sort of practical issues here. So I'm going to talk about Firefox, Camino and Safari all in their latest versions. In fact the Camino one is in version 2 beta at the moment. Okay so this is Firefox. What I like about Firefox is that um, it has a lot of nice plugins available for it. Things for example like the post Twitter which is very convenient. Um, things like the eBay um, t toolbar that you can get for it, the Firefox Companion for eBay, which is very good. Uh, its drawback, as far as uh, as far as working on the Mac goes, is that it's not a very Mac-like browser. In fact, it's very PC-like. Um, not as bad, obviously, as Internet Explorer, which even in version eight looks dreadful, cluttered, and ugh horrible and constantly bombarding you with pop-up boxes um, which none of these other browsers seem to do but anyway back to Mozilla Firefox um, yeah uh, it, it's, its drawback is really that it doesn't work with the Mac keychain which is a shame because the keychain for you PC users out there is a brilliant piece of software which stores all passwords and any kind of information that you that you want in sort of post-it notes style things all in a very secure way uh, which you can access at any time you like so that when you come ac across a site that needs a password that you've been to before the uh, the keychain will take care of it for you whereas Firefox obviously stores its own passwords a bit like um, uh, Internet Explorer or something like that. Uh, if you lose that installation of Firefox for any reason then you've got to start again uh, whereas uh, Time Machine will back up the, uh, the keychain for, for, um, for Mac users and you'll never lose your passwords. So that's Firefox. Um, I use it occasionally from time to time. Okay. Camino, I'm a bit new to Camino, um, it is from the same company as Firefox except that it is only available for the Mac, it does use the keychain, however there aren't nearly as many plugins available for it, I, do I mean plugins or add-ons, whatever I mean, um, for example I can't find a Twitter add-on for, uh, for Camino at all. Uh, neither can I find um, things like the eBay companion or anything like that and uh, I've got a widget, an eBay widget, um, it's not actually uh, on my widget screen at the moment so I won't even try, uh, but that seems to be a bit rubbish really um, and uh, I have to constantly update it by hand. So I don't like that. Um, so also with Camino I'm getting too many ads popping up even with the ad protection on, uh, certainly um, I find myself sometimes being led right away from the site that I wanted to go to. So um, don't really use Camino too much, although I do like its colourfulness uh, compared to Safari, which is my default browser. Um, it wasn't for about a week while I was trying out Camino. Uh, let's quit Camino. Quit Firefox. Go into Safari. Uh, Safari seems to have had the the tabs at the top thing um, deleted for some reason. I don't mean deleted. I mean sort of taken off. Its main or one of its main features was the fact that um, you had the browser the the tabs browsing thing along the top here. So if I make a new tab here now, you can see that it's just in the same place as it ever used to be. Um, I don't know quite why they changed it to be honest. I quite like them being at the top because it you get got more screen. This is your top sites thing here, uh, which um, a lot of fuss has been made about. Um, I personally don't use it. Uh, 
And really, that is the PSC Guide to Browsers. Safari, I think, is probably my best one. Uh, again, not so many plugins for it, although I did find something called Safari 140, which does let you post to Twitter. Uh, it puts a little um, item in the file menu, saying post to Twitter, which you can press Control and T for to get if you, if you wish to do that. Um, I actually quite like post to Twitter because I like sending um, good sites to my Twitter feed. If you want to follow me at tw um, on Twitter, by the way, it's uh, www.twitter.com forward slash PSE, um, which I'll put in my info thing. All right, okay, so that really is my default, my, uh, default browser and my guide to browsing. Use Safari. It's a lot less fuss and bother.